we will learn the types of screen so this is the basic screen or the blank screen so we'll inter we'll we'll insert new screen blank screen so screen 2 will be exactly like this now we'll insert <coughs> scrollable screen i have covered scrollable screen in detail uh, so this section is scrollable so if you want to make scrollable screen this is what you should use it will put a, a scroll bar and you can extend the height of the canvas so so scrollable now we'll introduce a list so this is basically a gallery and uh, two controls so quickly it will give you a gallery with this you know you can insert uh, custom controls also but these are some pre-built screens which they have provided then success it's just a message this was successfully completed next one is tutorial so if you run this if you run this success there is nothing that happens but in this one in screen 6 you can see that it will go to new page and then on skip then it will end so this is screen 6 uh, then comes uh, email So this is uh, to and basically you can run this. It's a functional one. If I type my name here, yeah, it found me. So it's functional one. Uh, I type test a test message from Power Apps. Let's click the send button. I don't know if the mail came, but we can test. Oh, it's a functional app, man. <laughs> okay, so that's the email. So it's quickly built, ready. So then we go to people. This is, these are all the screens provided by Microsoft. And this is also functional. If I search for all alum, it, can, it will search. There is no one else. Oh, I guess. It's another one and so it's a functional people search you can use this in your application so that's people search this one was email and before this it was just a, a tutorial screen this is a confirmation message so let's see another screen meeting This also is functional where you can invite people, schedule the time. Okay, this is also a functional uh, uh, one. I run this, I can put today's it. Okay, time, add location, schedule, invite. Uh, test, meet. testing then schedule is okay for half an hour time no available time <laughs> okay one hour 627 that's today let's schedule it so this is only partly functional so screen 9 is uh, not functional but calendar Calendar control. Today is 27th, June 2021. So, calendar control is functional. Okay. Actually, it's hitting the event. So, let's try. Let's try. Let's try. My calendar. What's the date today? 27th is 3.19 p.m. Let's schedule something. A test. Alam. 
27, 10 a.m. to, no, 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 27, 4 p.m. to 4.30 p.m. Send. So, if I, I'm not sure if it will pick this. may not pick because it may not be functional anyway so we gave it a try so new screen split screen where you can put controls on each side so you can put your button here so oh it went here then you click here then you click button so you can put your controls on either side of the screen so that is a split screen then sidebar you can put left navigation then top navigation controls so like you can put button one and so on then three uh, section screen this is the header section and the footer uh, is quite common in websites so then portrait is simple and landscape is what we use okay so these are all the types of screens you can use them as you need some of them functional some of them partly functional but you can tweak them to meet your requirements that's all about screen